Welcome back to the Gnome Show, everyone. I am Josh, your humble host, and it's my duty to draw uh, trawl the blind. Uh, it is my duty uh, to trawl the briny depths of YouTube so that I might bring I may bring you the shinies. Man, it's late. Uh, I cover short films of varying genres, uh, video games, analog horror, and sci-fi, and anything else I think is cool. I hope you'll enjoy tonight's offering. Uh, content for the blood god. Uh, I mean, on with the show. Uh, Right now, I have uh, Full Moon Studios, uh, and I have uh, two uh, parody shorts uh, for you. Uh, one is a Legion of the Dam parody, and the other is a Black Top uh, Templar parody. A parody. So, uh, let's boogie, ladies and gentlemen. Chaos Legion. We got Legion of the Dam, motherfucker. Yeah, see, um, yeah, like, uh, like it'd be interest. It's you know, it'd be one thing with like some of the other Chaos Legions or some of the other legions that might interact with Stormtroopers with the uh, Legion of the Damned. They're only there for one reason. Mm-hmm. All betrayers will burn. Heck yeah. <laughs> when you said you were going to tell me a war story, I was expecting another rant about how much you hate droids. Not a nightmare sequence of flaming spectral warriors slaughtering clones. And if they were ghostly entities, why did they need armor? That doesn't really make any sense. N never mind. Why were they so bent on killing you guys anyway? They didn't seem to approve of Order 66 for some reason. They were really pissed about it. They didn't say much, but finding out about how we betrayed and killed our former comrades seemed to really tick them off. Huh. So how'd you make it out? Dunno. Last thing I remember was watching my brothers get fried. Pissing myself and passing out. Woke up sometime later still alive. whoop de frickin' do. <laughs> oh man, I I'm sorry. <sighs> Rough day. Yeah. Rough day. See what I mean? And one more from him. Uh, and uh, I mean, everybody should like this one. Oh, no. Are you doing this? All I wanted was to spread joy. Your words are wasted on me, witch. <laughs> Our suspicions were correct, as we thought his beasts had no physical means of flight. Clearly, that of the warp was at work here. The Emperor's judgment upon this filth was deserved. Very good, brother. A little they harsh. They didn't deserve to live in the Emperor's galaxy. I did find something else. He appears to have had in his possession a very long assortment of names. They appear to be names of citizens in something called the Naughty and Nice List. Intended for more heresy, no doubt. 
Look at this. It contains detailed information about this world's citizens. Even the most intimate, private aspects of their lives are here. Fantasy. Only the Emperor may possess such omnipotence. What else was in this heretic's possession? Brother Zephyrus, have you found anything? <laughs> toys. What was that, brother? Toys. He was carrying toys. Toys? What kind of sick game was this witch playing at? Some dark ritual involving this world's youth? Even I shudder at the thought of what foul corruption was intended upon this world. Brother, what is that you're holding in your hands? A wooden sword. I can see that. Now tell me why you're holding it with such familiarity. When I was a boy, before becoming an aspirant, there was a saint entombed on my world. Great servant of the Emperor. In life he carried a divine sword, a beautiful blade. There was even a local craftsman that made wooden replicas. I always wanted one, and had hoped my mortal parents would get me one. They never did. Oh. Is there a reason you're telling us this story, brother? Because he just this got his old, sword. An exact replica. Of that great saint's divine weapon. More trickery. Do not succumb to such obvious attempts at manipulation, brother. I hope Santa gets back it's up. Even in the craftsman's style. What is this sentiment? I thought you were a black Templar, not some sentimental soul. Easily tended by nostalgia, you should probably speak with the chaplain when we return. Now, let's get this all secured. The Inquisition will want to examine the wreckage. No. Just burn it. Burn it all. Wow. Oh, Merry Belated Christmas. <laughs> there is only war, no Santa. Full Moon Studios, go on and uh, check out his other stuff. Um, it's not a whole lot of stuff, but it's quality stuff. Um, he's got some good stuff here. Stuff, stuff, stuff. Um, leave your comments down below what you thought about this uh, fine animation. Um, like, subscribe, and share. I love you all, and I'll see you in the next one.